But first, here is Margot Lau to show us the different ways to make delicious recipes from raw food. My name is Margot Lau. I am a raw foodie. I also teach Ashtanga Yoga, Yin Yoga, and Anti-Gravity Yoga. I'm a very active person. I'm actually a mother of two. And when I turned 39, I realized na I was very tired, although I was very healthy, I was a vegetarian, and then I practice yoga every day. But I felt that I didn't have that much energy that I, I had when I was younger. So I really wanted to look for a healthy way of eating. I wanted to find something that I could, I'm able to sustain all the activities I want in the day. So I really tried to look into raw foodism. And then when I started my last year, I really had so much energy. I felt really good. All my allergies, I'm actually, uh, I have rhinitis, I have a lot of allergies. Pimples, I have seborrheic dermatitis, typical problems when you, when you get older. And all these disappeared after I, I started eating a lot more greens, I started eating a lot more fruits. My daily routine, I actually get up around 5.30. And then I prepare all my food now. I prepare my juices. I drink one liter of green juice a day. And then if I am going to be very active that day, I prepare another one liter of uh, green smoothie. And then I have a lots of baon because I don't want to get hungry. When I start getting hungry, that's really the time that I start cheating. I start eating whatever. Because I'm so hungry. Eh. So I go out I really have a bout. I have fruit, I have green smoothies, I also have the green juices, and it really lasts me throughout the day. This is what I do in the morning. When I wake up in the morning, I prepare my juice. That's like baon ko nilang sa maga. And then right after I do yoga or I do um, running or, or I go gymnastics, this is what I drink. The first thing is I put some cucumber. Cucumber is actually equivalent to three glasses of water. So just one cucumber hydrates you. And then um, I put some ampalaya. It can clean out the blood and the toxins. So I really I put this one. I don't miss this. I put some sugar beets. I like my juice to be a little bit sweet. Sugar beets is really good for the liver. It's a liver detoxifier. And I put some, you know, some tomatoes. Because, I don't know, when I was young, diba, they say na if you, put, if you eat a lot of kamatis, you'll have really rosy cheeks. So I put some kamatis. And then um, I have some pechai here, pechai greens. And then um, I have some carrots for beta-carotene. Uh, actually, ever since I've been taking this green juice, I noticed that no yung astigmatism na mata ko. I noticed that I have better eyesight. Does that make sense? And then just to taste, no, I don't want to put a little, a lot of sweet fruit. So I just put, just to make it a little sweet, so it's easier for me to, to take. I just put some green apples. I've been doing a lot of green smoothies. It just, I just did a lot of free demos in most yoga studios around the country. I'll start with um, putting some, some carrots, ampalaya, just put everything in. First, they were really skeptical because they see a lot of greens and then usually when you see the color green, you associate it with something that doesn't taste good or taste like ampalaya, or taste like dahon. And um, um, they were very surprised when they make the green smoothies. They really like it because it really tastes like dessert. Cucumber, of course. And then, um, tomato. A lot of people have been approaching me, especially for detox. Now they want to go on detox, they want to lose weight. And I always tell them that um, in my experience, I experienced so much fad diets in my life that I realized really that it's not important to um, starve yourself. You have to feed yourself nutrients and these nutrients really come from fresh fruits and vegetables. And when you're able to reset your, your taste buds, reset your body, 
you don't have that much cravings for a lot of foods that you used to crave. So it's more of a transitional diet if you want to get into raw food from a cooked food diet. If you notice, you see all that bubble on top. Don't take the bubbles because it causes gas and we don't like gas. So actually, what's good about this jug is just you pour it out and then it just separates the bubbles from the juice. And then um, this is actually what I drink. It's really, really super hydrating. This is what you need every day. This is what your body needs. These are like good enzymes, nutrition that your body is really hungry for. Cheers! Yum! It's so good. If you're just starting out with this type of diet, the best is to just have like a green smoothie a day or a green juice a day. Just incorporate um, fresh fruits and vegetables into your diet. When you're eating white rice, you can substitute it by um, having more fruit. If you're still hungry, you can have a little brown rice. Uh, and then um, you can do away with white sugar and instead have a lower glycemic sugar like uh, cocoa sugar. That would be good. I think that uh, whatever we eat really uh, defines who we are. If uh, we're eating unhealthy, then it defines how we feel. If we feel bad about what we eat, we feel bad about who we are. And the more healthy we're eating, the more that we're really actually taking care of our body. And the more we take care of it, the more energy we feel, the happier we are. And the more fruits and vegetables that you eat, it's, it's amazing. You, it's like this sudden burst of energy and you want to go out and you have to go out, exercise, walk, run under the sun. It really wants to make you just get up and go. It changes your whole outlook in life and uh, it makes you happier. It uh, alleviates depression. What I've been doing um, being vegetarian, being more vegan, being going through the source of all living foods, I feel that that goes hand in hand with what I'm, with I'm, what I'm practicing, which is yoga. You are more compassionate to all the living creatures, and I feel that it's made me happier. It's made me a better person, and there's a lot of good karma that I'm feeling that. You know, that I'm doing a lot of free juicing, free demos, and I don't really earn anything from all these, but I feel good. It fulfills.